Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I will be texturizing my hair. I am trying this brand out for the first time. I don't know, it says texture your way. Mm -hmm. And we're also going to be dyeing it as well. We'll see how that comes out. So inside, wow, look at how I opened this box. Inside we have the texturizer the pre-texturized application shampoo conditioner and lotion so many many things in here all right so there's different descriptions on there this pre-texturizing lotion i think is for people that already have like it says for if you have virgin hair don't use it and my hair is basically virgin because this is brand new growth from when i was bald so we're just gonna go right into step two, which is the actual texturizer. It says application process should take about three minutes and then depending on how loose you want the curls to be, it could be from four minutes to eight minutes. So I think we're just gonna do like five. I think it's right about time to go wash it out and I'll be right back clearly we went wrong somewhere and I'm saying we because we were doing this together you guys are watching me do it um left it on too long because now it's like like this part looks curly but the rest is like super straight it straightened out so quick like so so quick but I've also never used this brand before, so I didn't really know what to expect. But anyways, we move to the next part. I'm just letting this dry out a little bit more. So this is the color we're doing today. It's going to be this Red Hot Rhythm by Dark and Lovely. Lovely, I just did it on my mom and it came out so cute. So now I'm gonna do it. Um, Let's see. So of course we have the huge 20 developer, it's actually 25 volume developer conditioner and the hair, hair dye itself. And of course we have gloves in here and the instruction, instructions, instructions, the instructions tell you to definitely not dye your hair if it's already like bleached or I mean relaxed, but you know we don't listen here. That's why we always thank God for wigs because wigs save lives all right so just mix in the formula put the pour all of the air dye hair dye or air dye hair dye inside the developer shake it together run it over no just kidding shake it together and we're going to get in there and i don't have a comb so we're just going to go right in. I honestly don't know how this is going to turn out. So we're going to find out together. Oh my God. It's like spilling all over my legs. It kind of burns a little, but that's because I just, I thought I had like a bald spot, but my hair is just thinning over there. So this is what we're working with here. It's okay, all this will come off. So I'm just going to cover it with the shower cap so it can help it process faster come back after I wash it so I just took up the um, shower cap I had it on for about like 15 minutes I want to say and this it looks really really dark right now but the color is gonna show once I wash it off so 
Don't worry. Are you ready for the big reveal? It looks good. I feel like right now it looks a little crazy because it's not styled. But I actually don't mind it. Oh, my scalp is hurting a little bit. Do you like it, Sharon? You do? It kind of looks brown. Yeah, like brown. Like in the middle? It looks like it's brown, but on the side kind of looks red. Is this a success? It's definitely a success. Last time. That Last was... time it was a major fail. How does it look? Comment in the section. So we're done. I was going to style it, but I feel like now I'm going to make that in another video. So this is the end of this video. I feel like I should have at least done my makeup for you guys, right? Well, I'll do my eyebrows. Ready. <laughs> that is the end of this video. Thank you for tuning in and going on this journey with me. You guys did play me though and let me leave it on, leave the texturizer on for too long, but that's okay. Um, this is the result of the hair dye. I really actually like the color because it's not so bright. It's still like tones with my skin tone, so it looks good. Mm -hmm. But anyways, that is the end of this video. Thank you for tuning in. If you have any questions, please link it or put it in the comment box below. I'll put the name of the hair dye and texturizer I used. I don't know how I feel about that texturizer, but I'll put it down anyways. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.